Hello everyone, this is Shailija, working as a principal in AP Model School in Edwimla. So recently we have taken training in IIM Ahmedabad. So it is quite fruitful to us and uh, we learned a lot in that training. So after coming to our school, we like to uh, implement so many strategies uh, what we learned there. So among them, the first one is gamification. So just uh, I mingled with students and I introduced uh, guess a word game and uh, uh, I have given uh, first of all some uh, letters uh, and then after that they have to guess the word the children are divided into two groups A and B first of all there was a confusion among children when I introduced the game in the beginning and latter what I did so uh, alphabetical order so here first day A, A letter and second day B letter, third day C letter like that. So I told them and what they did. So daily they refer dictionary and then they have written nearly 25 to 30 words and among those words I have conducted game. So it will be easy for them uh, to guess that the right word and then by this what I learned is uh, they, are, they, are, they tend to refer dictionary and then they are noting down the meanings as well and after that I am conducting spell B game also. That is the main uh, result I got from this gamification. The second thing what I started in my school is, so from 6th to 10th standard, so each class and section has given a title and then uh, in that class all the students are divided into different groups that is uh, 7 to 8 groups like that for example if you take uh, the title for uh, one section is missiles and in that class we have divided students into different groups and we have allotted some names like Prudvi, Naga, Akash, all missiles names like that and then what we are doing here so in all the sections that is from 6th to 10th uh, the students will be divided into different groups and they have given different activity to, uh, activities also so in each and every subject that is not confined to one subject that is english or some math like that in each and every subject teacher are, uh, teachers are divided into the students are divided into different groups and teachers are allotting different work with them and then and the best performance so who did the best performance in the, in the class those students that group will be displayed in the display board this is uh, this gives some sort of encouragement to the students and then in the gamification also the best class will be displayed in um, displayed uh, in the display board so along with the section photo that is this is the second thing what i implemented in my school and the third thing as uh, as the public examinations are nearby so we have been taking remedial classes for, for, for a 10th as well as for uh, inter first year and second year also and equally we have been taking classes for the 6th to 9th also already the 9th syllabus is completed we have taking classes for uh, uh, we, have, we are covering the syllabus of 10th class and then 6th we are giving good base 6th and 7th and then in the next year it will be uh, we, uh, we can implement these ideas in a fruitful manner and almost we are getting good, uh, good results also. Finally what I want to say that a leader should not show path to others. First of all he or she should walk in that path and automatically the rest of the people will follow in that path. And what we learned in an IIM training that is Vidya Vinyoga Vikasa. So the education must be used and in order to get fruitful results we have to implement it every and what we are doing is the same thing we have uh, for where we have been following the same thing and then automatically generally in all the institutions also we will get the same results good results fruitful results thank you to IIM and team and uh, the all the members who gave us good knowledge which helped uh, to work uh, uh, in uh, in our career and as well as in uh, in my life also